Drinking my $5 water bottle. Oh, cheesy. I don't know if I've ever had jackfruit before. Not a fan. Mommy's go go juice. $7 in this economy. That's gonna hurt my tummy in a minute. Welcome to the channel. We are obviously at Disneyland and it is the transition between fall to Christmas decor which I cannot wait for. I'm so excited for this Vlogmas this holiday season and I thought I would do one of my favorite videos ever today. Ollie's here by the way and it's Whit's <laughs> birthday. Yay! And I'm gonna share with you guys all the things that I eat today and I'll share the prices with you as well because we all know Disney food is delicious but also expensive. So let's see how much we spend. Let's see what we eat and let's just see how the day goes. And we'll be looking out for the dilfs of Disney. <gasps> you said that, not me. We're starting with bow buns. I am Ollie walking through Disney with a Telbar bag on my arm. Oh, let's not get hit by the car. Sorry, sir. I'm Ollie strutting my stuff down this runway. Guys, this way. Strut your stuff down that runway, baby. Give me a strut. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Adventureland, here we come. Fuck me up on some Dole Whip. Am I right, ladies? Hell yeah. Tropical hideaway. In case you didn't know, they do bow buns, lumpia, and flavor, different flavored dough. Let's go. Ooh, yummy. You can also do swirls of the flavors. Getting our swirl on. Ooh, ooh. Thank you so much. She's tall. The best chips ever. Bows and different lumpias. Look a mocha. Ooh, I want an egg. All right, we got all of our little snackies. We got the three bow, two lumpia, and the Dole Whip to share. Total was $34.99. First day bite of the Dole Whip. Let's go. I'm excited. Good? I mean, the mango is so wrong. good. I've never had a mango version of a Dole Whip before. It's so yum. yummy. You guys gotta try it. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, wow. It tastes like a candle. It's giving gummy bear. It's giving Bath and Body Works. I love it. I love Bath and Body Works. <laughs> so this is a Loco Moco bun. If you don't know what Loco Moco is, we did it in an episode of Cooking with Remy. It is rice, the hamburger patty, gravy, and an egg on top. It's a Hawaiian fusion meal. It's delicious. And this is in bun form. Here we go. Oh, honestly, I was hoping for like a whole egg. I thought there was going to be a whole egg in it, but that's okay. Delicious. It's good. It doesn't taste like Loco Moco at all, but it's good. I give it an eight out of 10. Oh, that crunch. I cut into the jackfruit banana and there's like actual real chunks of jackfruit. I don't know if I've ever had jackfruit before. Not a fan. I don't love, but the crunchy caramel is good. We just ate and now we're getting Starbucks because she gets a free birthday Starbucks. We're following the birthday girl around. We got a genie pass, which is like a fast pass kind of thing now for my favorite ride. Is it your favorite ride too? Thunder Mountain? Yeah. Or you like Haunted Mansion? Haunted Mansion. Haunted Mansion for him, Thunder Mountain for me, and we got a fast pass for Thunder Mountain, and I can't wait. We're in Starbucks, and I think I'm gonna get my first holiday drink of the season. The holiday drinks, we've got the ice sugar cookie almond milk latte, which I think I'm gonna do hot with peppermint added, but there's also a peppermint mocha frappe and a caramel brulee latte. Yum. Look at these cute little cake pops. I love everything Christmas holiday themed. Okay, I got my Starbucks. I got a. Grande sugar cookie almond milk latte with two pumps of peppermint. And this was $7.21, which is a lot for a Starbucks. Really? The first holiday drink of the season. <gasps> it tastes like a candle again. Got the cute little Disney cup. Wow, this is so good. I think this might be better than a white peppermint mocha. Actually, I don't know. As I was saying it, I think I lied. I think I like a white peppermint mocha better, but this is delicious. Getting some water bottles. 1581. We're waiting to have our fast pass ride be ready. So we're shopping around. I love lounge fly. Look at wet. They're furry pink ones with little Mickey giblets. Wait, honestly, I will wear these and I'm not the biggest Crocs girl. I love them. I would wear them. They're so oh, cute. They so Drinking my $5 water bottle. Stay hydrated, hydration nation people. We're walking this way because we can go to Thunder Mountain slash get a snack. TBT when there used to be McDonald's french fries on the outside of Thunder Mountain. Rest in peace, I miss them. This is fantastic. We're sharing everything so we can eat as much food as possible yes. today. We found a pretzel booth well, and we're gonna get one. Unfortunately, they don't have the cream cheese ones here as far as I know, so that will be for later. But for now, a fresh, hot, till the cows come home pretzel. They have a Mickey. Oh, Mickey with cheese or regular Mickey or jalapeno cheese filled. I think I'm gonna go with Mickey shaped regular. 
for just a mere seven dollars and a mere seven dollars in this economy. It's actually a lot for a pretzel, <laughs> but we're gonna share. This is an Erewhon Disney pretzel. Organic. Organic. This is a tub of cheese. This was milk yum, this morning. Yum. Honestly, I would eat that with a spoon. <laughs> Give me the phone. Double homicide. Damn, double, double homicide. homicide. Wow, we got a full production. The block oh, You know what I'm gonna do? Brother. I'm gonna take his ear right off. He can hear too much. Mmm. It's gonna hurt my tummy in a minute. A little dry. Oh. <laughs> I'm being really picky with food today. Yes, Gordon. It's good. She's really helped. Put a little mm. rainwater on it. Mm. <laughs> Perfect. Seven and a half out of ten. Oh wow. The cream cheese one gets a ten. Rip the ear off. Yeah. Hawk shit. This is what happened. A little oh, dipper in. Just a Some cheese. It ain't no Auntie Anne's, but I love it. That's exactly what I would say. It is time for something sweet again. We're walking to get a Mickey beignet. Love a beignet, beignet lover. I do love a beignet. Ben, yay! I have to say the ones in the park are not as good as the ones in downtown Disney, but I'll take what I can get right now. Any fried dough, I am not mad at. Just kidding, there's like 50 people in line. So the beignets were a no for now, but the Bengal barbecue is open and delicious. And if you didn't know, you can get a skewer of meat at Disneyland and they're delicious. There we go, right here. Right across from Indiana Jones. All right, here are our options. We got beef, we got chicken, vegetable, safari, bacon, rock asparagus. There's a pork belly. Oh my god! All right, we got three skewers. Oh, thank you so much. And a breadstick. This bread is shaped like a little tigger tail, and I love to see that. Chicken. It tastes like wood brand. Mmm. Beef, and she's steaming. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Chicken, seven out of ten. Beef, eight and a half out of ten. Bread break. Cheesy. Finished with a little pork belly. Oh my god. The veggies on top? Ten. Six. That ended up being so good that we went back and got another steak and the veggies. Is that pesto? I don't know what's on it. But it was $13.99 for both. And it looks delicious with a little lemon wedge. He's eating a pepper. I'm not just saying that. That was the best thing I've had today. Slash quite possibly one of the best things I've ever had at Disney in general. That was so good. That was so good. Mmm. Oh, good. Amazing. Fun fact, this Coca-Cola refreshment center is where the cream cheese pretzel is sold. And I believe maybe only here. Miss Birthday Girl, what do you want? I didn't know something sweet. She wants something sweet. I'm so full, but I too can go for something sweet. Oh my gosh. They have the churro tonti. Oh man. Oh man. We have a strawberry pop tart down there. Ooh, can't say no to that. Munchlings. Oh my god, you guys, I want to sell, get these. I'm going to get these for everyone. So you can get any of these. I really want the Oogie Boogie. I would love the little mini Baymax as well. Guys, wait, I want to get everyone a surprise Munchling. So pick which one you want oh and let's open them. I Yay! Thanks, Miss Remy. Munchling. Wait, I, everyone hold on to yours because I don't want to get them mixed up. Oh, okay. okay. Yay, there we go. Got our little cake pops. Come here, Miss Wit. Is it a cake pop or is it an apple? Actually, we're not sure what this is. Let's see. Yeehaw! Mm. Oh, that's a cake pop. Oh, mm. like a brownie cake pop. Mm. Okay, so the cake pops were $5.99 each, and then each munchling was $16.99. And I did get one for Mo, and I did get one for Daisy. <laughs> I'm a little disappointed with mine, if I'm being honest. She's disappointed? We can trade. No, no, no. You're Should so we sweet. look? Yes, one, two, three. <gasps> did you get it? Wait, come, come, come. Wait, this was so cute. I got you this! Got the I got mini. <laughs> Wait, my guesses were so wrong. It smells like a strawberry shortcake doll. This That's one so is more Momo, I would say. Now for a daisy. I got the poo. Oh, Oh my god, so cute. So I got neither that I wanted, but that's okay. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Beautiful. Best drink in the world. It's every time. It's like a passion fruit. It's so good. Mommy's go go juice. Wait, why is it not recording? That's dangerous. So good. Right? It's so good. It tastes like juice. Oh god. <laughs> All right, dinner. Yeah. We've got a burger and fries, lobster nachos, which are so good. Look at this baby. Oh. We got a chicken plate. Yum. Yeah. Yeah. All right, nachos, lobster, everything. Those are really good. Ten out of ten. We got the bill. Can we get the bill? Uh, uh. Delicious. 
I'm full. Finishing our night with hot chocolate for the birthday girl. She's never had Ghirardelli hot chocolate. And this is my favorite thing to get. When I was in college and would come with all my sorority sisters late at night, we get a hot cup of hot cocoa from Ghirardelli, which like, it's so, what did I say? It was decadent and rich and rich. smooth and delicious. Alpha so. gamma pie girl. Just getting our little hot cocoa for the boys. For the boys. So we're getting some. This looks amazing. Their regular hot chocolate is amazing. Oh, you can create your own shape. We've got a frozen hot cocoa. There are sundaes. I want something hot, but that frozen hot cocoa looks really good. Oh, their regular hot cocoas are here. Oh, perfect. Classic sea salt caramel. It's peppermint bark time. I came in the store to look for it. Oh, you can make your own bag. Amazing. I've got those little mini dark chocolates, and they're so good, and I want to get more. We found a full menu. They've got all these ice Brownie. creams. Look at the cookie crumble hot fudge sundae. They've got decadent drinking chocolate, classic hot cocoa, or sea salt caramel hot cocoa. Ooh, decadent. All right, our three small peppermint hot chocolates, which by the way, we found that there's a peppermint one for 2020. A little scared. We got our peppermint hot cocoa. It's good. It smells so good. Yes. I haven't tasted it yet. Oh my so god. Good. I'm so excited. It smells amazing. I have all the nostalgia. The oh my god, it's so so good. Guys, we got our heart. <laughs> we got our heart. We got our heart. We got our hot chocolate. Everyone, what do we think? Absolutely fantastic. Life changing. It really is the best hot chocolate I've ever had in my life. It tastes like liquid gold. It's amazing. We did get peppermint hot chocolate because they had a special one for Christmas. That about wraps up this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Don't forget to check out the vlog channel to see the behind the scenes of the day. It was a lot of fun. Also, I have to get home decently early because Ashley Tisdale and Chris Olson are coming on the podcast tomorrow. If you didn't know, I have a podcast with Alicia called pretty basic check it out we've got amazing guests and it's just an all-around amazing time love you guys happy birthday Wit. thank you happy birthday Wendy. happy Let's birthday <laughs> okay bye